Hello guys, my name is James Contrast and in this video I'm gonna show you how to use the touch shortcut in Photoshop on the iPad Pro. In Photoshop, by default the touch shortcut tool can be found in the bottom left corner but you can move it around to wherever you want it to be. but I'm pretty happy with it right here. So I like to use the touch shortcut tool together with the move tool right here. So if I look at my layers, I could choose the, let me see, I could go for the Hero 8 layer and use the touch shortcut tool right now and as you can see right here it is now set to move constraint which means that I can move this label right now only in the x-axis if I wanted to so as you can see it's not possible to move it in the y-axis and this comes in very handy to your adjustments. So on the other side if I choose it and start to move the label in the y-axis it is also possible as you can see but no movement in the x-axis. Alright so every shortcut tool has a second function and is actually activated by pressing and moving it to the outer circle and as you can see right now the second function of the move tool is duplicate so right now if I tap and move it I can easily duplicate my layer and get the same right here and can do it over and over again. So the second tool I like to use with the touch shortcut from the toolbar is the brush tool and as you know normally you can draw things but if you press and hold the touch shortcut it changes the function to erase and I can easily erase all I just draw before and the second function will be the eyedropper tool so let's say I wanna have exactly the GoPro blue and as you can see it is already selected in my color picker tool so now I can brush in the same color as the GoPro from my image. Now if you want to take a look at all the possible touch shortcuts inside Photoshop, you just have to tap on the help icon in the top right corner and there you can display all the available touch shortcuts at a glance. Well guys, that's it for today, thanks for watching. Please leave a comment down below, hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for more free content like this. And I shall see you guys in the next video.